huge. There was a picture that from 1984. What's that? Mountain Life and Work magazine of Appalachian South. Um, what was that from? Because it, it was that around that time period that you were talking about. Uh, well, at Rubbermaid, that was in the 70s, but um, okay. the Mountain Life and Work is when I worked as a union carpenter. I'm union to the bone. Um, okay. As a single mom making five bucks an hour as a secretary, I needed to make more money to save my home so that I didn't lose it and um, to help my children have what they deserved and needed. And um, so I got into the carpentry apprenticeship program. And so that's a picture of me working at Wright-Patterson Air Force Base. And um, we, uh, as a result of being a woman in the trades, I found out very quickly we needed support. So I organized and was successful in establishing a 501c3 um, organization called Blue Collar Women. And so we focused on helping women and minority males get into the trades, learn the ropes, learn how to fight back, and learn to stand tall. And do your job. Don't ever be a token. Don't ever have a token attitude. Mm -hmm. We did a lot of great work there.